therapy session with Cyrus, right? Get excited. We're only all on the brink of death and have no SP. It'll be fine. Dude, double SP cost is rough. Do I have any, uh... Yeah, give him that. <laughs> Can't we settle this thing? No! <laughs> Why? I'm ready. Be no, 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 no. I saved. Everything's fine. These aren't the self destructy boys. Oh, let's uh, slow down just a little bit. Damn, I should have just given him BP. I didn't want him to die, though. Thunk, thunk, thunk. One for all. Bo da 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 da. Bo da 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 da. Wow, way to waste your turn there, bub. I'm gonna use my turn to go. be fast next turn. Okay. Oh, thank you. And, uh, uh, Lux Conjurer. You should have studied harder. One on on a one on on a no. What? I'm like on, I'm like sitting on the quest marker. It is inside Let's my body. For you. I'm ready. The peacock struck. <sighs> la la la. On paralleled. Thus ends your lesson. What? There we go. At long last, I can begin to study the tomes in earnest. High Hornbergian Dictionary. Yeah, buddy. An ancient tome detailing how the twelve gods sealed away an unholy power beyond the edge of the world. Trial of the Twelve, Volume 7. In the pages of this tome, the secrets banished by the gods are likened to a golden fruit, and an ominously worded warning is issued to any who would covet this forbidden power. Uh-oh. Is there going to be another boss? Ophelia's ending had... Did hers have two? It had two phases, kind of. It had the... The no. stupid... Minion guys. Burda, 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 burda. Wait, they're not weak to daggers. I'm bad. Oh no! Please don't self destruct on me, Papa. Okay, he can't self destruct on me now. Ooh. No, Tressa. What is the logical course of action? Glacius, Lordair. Gachoon, Gachoon, Gachoon. Burda, 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 burda. Out of my 
away. What to do? Try again. Thank you. There you go. Seven thousand dollar dues. Not bad. A passing grade. A passing grade. Alright, I don't trust this. So I'm actually gonna heal again. I don't trust it. A tome wherein is writ, in horrifying detail, a forbidden right to bring back the unholy power sealed away beyond the edge of this world. Yes. Yes, I see! I do believe I have the knowledge I need to decipher the mural. Alright. I still don't trust it. Can't we settle this like gentlemen? I am ready. The peacock struck. Ba -na -ba -ba -ma. Why does that only last three turns? You... Oh, because it normally lasts two. Duh. Good job, boy. Well done. Now the true lesson begins. Lux conjure. <laughs> Let's do this. Thank you. So much easy moanies. Oh, sacred light. Ba -ba -na 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 -na. I grow strong. That's true. It's like with each fifth battle, but yes, that's true. Open for business. I'm ready. The peacock struck. Of action. My focus, glacius, Claudette. Boom, baby. Not bad. A passing grade. That's a lot of damage. Did Tressa, did it say she just found 4,000 on the ground? Did I read that properly? Uh, uh-oh. Death, doom, destruction, 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 death, doom, destruction. Uh oh. You glean new information. Now then. Now let me think through all I've learned. The twelve gods sealed power away beyond the edge of the world. The forbidden power they sealed away was destruction. 
No? Cyrus, didn't you just read the damn thing? The power of... Life and death. But of course! Indeed! The power of life and death! That is the forbidden secret held within these pages. Trial of the Twelve tells the tale of how the Twelve Gods sealed this power away. The author of Forbidden Gold compares this power to a golden fruit. You know, it's like the Triforce, but edible. Like a golden fruit it calls out to and tempts the human heart. Into the pages of From the Far Reaches of Hell was this power sealed. These glyphs. Yes, I believe I can decipher them now. Death, 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 death. Doom, 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 doom. Destruction, 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 destruction. I think we could safely assume this is a warning of sorts. You think? A warning of the calamity that awaits us if the gate is opened, and the forbidden unleashed. <laughs> Were they left as an invitation or a warning? Uh, you just but said... of course! Yes, the mural was left behind as a warning. I am sure of it. Indeed. Knowledge in and of itself is not inherently good or evil. It can, however, serve other purpose. All depends on the heart of he who would use it. I choose to believe that whoever created this mural so many years ago believed the same. For the sake of our future, be not tempted by the darkness. Indeed. Yes, these dark secrets must never be allowed to be put into practice. The mere existence of this tome is a threat. Shall I destroy it and banish its baleful knowledge for all eternity? Mm. Not exactly. No. Destroying the tome would not banish the darkness that exists in the heart of man. If there is evil in this world, it lurks in the hearts of man. And as long as that darkness exists, people will find a way to work evil. I must preserve this knowledge that we might put it to good use, not evil. Thusly. And yet there is much more I must learn. I must decipher in full the contents of this tome and the murals in this place. And pass them on to those who would follow us. That one day should we be threatened by forces from the far reaches of hell. He said it! Yes. Our descendants will possess the knowledge needed to protect this realm. First, I must return to Atlas Dam and file a report on what I have seen here. Then I must begin my analysis of the material I have collected. <laughs> yes, I'll be burning the midnight oil night after night, no doubt. I can scarcely wait. Foreshadowing is a powerful literary tool. Professor! Professor! Over here, Therese! Oh, I didn't even see him there. That stack of books seems to get bigger every time I see you. And I'll need twice again as many to have any hope of translating this ancient tome. Twice as many? No, three times as many. He said twice again as many. That means that many books, two times, like two more of those shipments. Three times as many, threes. Jesus, don't you pay attention in class? Uh, no wonder he liked the princess better. certain region mentioned a gate of sorts. And I could not help but notice a parallel to the mural I found. I see. Hence, these books on local folklore? Just so. Considering your subject from all possible angles is a fundamental principle of scholarly research. Ah, but I forget myself. Might I surmise that you've come here to inform me that it's time for class? Uh, 
yes. You're late, Professor. Oh, shut up. What are you going to do? Me to me again? Pray forgive me, Your Highness. Oh, we have way more students now. Very well, then, my students. Let us begin. To quote the words of one Susanna Grotoff, author of Knowledge is Light. The pursuit of knowledge is a journey with no Get Waltzen. As long as people live, there is always something to learn. And so we learn. We record. We speak. Points connect, thus forming our history, our agency, our identity. This world we live in is not for or of any one individual, and neither is knowledge. And so I write and speak of all that I learned to plant seeds of knowledge that will be harvested by those who follow me. To you who have found my writings, read well these words. That they may help you build a bridge to a brighter future. Yay! Thanks, teacher. Aw, cute! Dude, these ending cards are adorable. Look at him! He fell asleep mid-word! What a legend, dude. What an absolute lad. What a baller. Greetings. This tome, the ancient capitals, contains a record of the ancient city of gold. Look, do you see? An entire city where everything is made of gold. I wish there were more details about it, but it's only the briefest mention. Oh, I have a... I already have that side quest. Well, now I'm over here! Do I still go to Ulbrich next? I think I'm closer to Tressa now. Wait, can I rob Therese? Therese! Oh, I can buy stuff from her. Known as the Moon of the Flatlands, she is Princess Mary's distant relative, and has been close with her since childhood. Though she may seem timid at first glance, her true colors show when it comes to matters of the heart. The heart. Oh, <gasps> Therese. Marry me. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, baby. Oh, yeah. Wait, how come you can use bows anyways? Is that sorcerer? Sorcerer can use bows? Weird. I mean, I guess I give him the tomahawk bow. Or the soul bow. But I'm never going to use it. I'm always just going to stay on this. God bless you, Therese. Me rich.
Did I get anything from beating that boss? I never look to see if I what like if anything dropped. I'm a huge goober. I don't know. Okay, place your votes, buckos. Should I go but do Ulbrich as planned? Or should I... Tressa's closer now. Who do you want, Ulbrich or Tressa? Pick, pick, pick. Go, go, go. Type, type, type. Tressa? Tressa! Okay, Tressa it is. I don't want to walk all the way there. Close your eyes, chat. Oh, wait. Sure. Hmm. I got one of your... This is the guy who wants the things, right? Hmm. Wait, no, this is the guy who wants his captain. I'm gonna beat your ass, kid. That'll motivate you to leave home. It is a good day for battle. Boom, boom, the battle boom, is boom. The battle is Keck. The thrill of the fight. Feel motivated now, kid? No? Okay. Oh, I can get the Leviathan Hunter back, too. Because that is the most godlike old man in the realm. I think this is my favorite battle music. I like the fanfare and like the outer, the highest level zones. But this one's the, the best. How about you? Time to collect. <laughs> yes, Ulbrick. Ignis Arden. Hello. You Goodbye. Studied harder. They weren't even broken, by the way. Oh, the Leviathan Hunter's gone. Oh, he's in the cave now because I finished the quest. Never mind. Let us fight Bummer. With honor. Well, boom, boom. What next? Oh, I don't have the half SP. Oh, uh oh. Whoops. Whoopsies. Let me uh, swap your talents around there, Cyrus, old buddy. I wonder if there's any uh, job shrines out here. What is the logical course of action? Ah, Ignis are dead. Kachunk, kachunk. Not bad. A passing grade. Koopa dee do, scoopa dee da, do, ba dee do. West Grand Port Coast. I don't see one. I see a dungeon. Who's this? Who are you? Oh, Best date. selling on. I'm a wandering writer. I travel the world writing my books as I flit from place to place. I just put out a new volume, in fact. Perhaps you heard of it? The Ancient Capitals, I called it. It's done rather well for itself. And even after I had to cut so much material from it, oh, the things I know could fill several volumes, not just that paltry one. 
This popular author travels the world, writing stories about people he meets, rumors he hears, and places he visits along the way. His elaborate and colorful descriptions, which bring the world within the pages to life, have been highly praised by readers. I don't think that's worth... whoops. Exploit weakness. Sure! Come with me. My pen is ready to pour forth onto the page. Oh, whoa, is that what they're calling it nowadays? If you touch me there, my pen is gonna pour onto the page! I am ready. The peacock struck. You missed. Wait, why does a bird know Meteor Storm? Hmm. I don't know about that one, Chief. My focus is a night risk to them. You should have studied harder. Twenty thousand leaves, dude. I'm big money now. One for all. I'm ready. Ouch. The peacock struts. It's my turn now. Venta Crabs are weak to the wind. Who would have thunk it? Who would have thunk it? Oh, big bird man. The peacock struck. Osiris oh, doesn't have enough SP. Shit! Now, what next? Ah, nothing will quiet the storm. Dab on him. You should have studied harder. Who needs big boy magic? Oh, you're back? You wanted more? I'm ready. Getting one-shotted wasn't enough? Hmm. If you insist. <sighs> Nothing will quiet the storm. You should have studied harder. Dude, my pen is gonna be the death of me. I swear to God.